Hi everybody, my name is Amber and I'm from the Feature Success team here at Software of Excellence. Today I'm going to be showing you how the new patient portal icons work on the arrivals tab of your appointment book. Uh, this was changed as per feedback from you guys to make this easier to see uh, what forms are required from each patient and what forms they've filled out so far. As you can see here, I am on my appointment book and I've got two appointments, one for Mr. Notes and one for Miss Test. On the Arrivals tab, we can see that only two forms are required from Mr. Notes, but five forms are required from Miss Test. So if the form isn't needed from the patient, as you can see here, the icon just will not show. All these icons at the moment are currently black. If they appear black, it means that they are currently incomplete. So they haven't been filled out by the patient on their portal. I'm gonna jump into Miss Test's portal page just now, and I've got that open ready on Google Chrome here. So this is the part the patient would do themselves. Here we go. So once we're logged in as Miss Test, we can see here that they've got multiple forms to fill out. So I'm going to go in quickly and fill out the first form here. We can see that's now been filled out and is sitting in the completed form section at the bottom of their portal screen. If we now go back into our exact, we can now see that the health screening form here has now changed to green. This means that that's now been completed. We also see over here on the right hand side that we've also got a medical alert highlighting to us that this patient could potentially be infectious. So if we double click on that now we can see that the COVID-19 potentially infectious alert is coming up on that patient as per the form that they filled out online. So this just allows you a really quick, easy oversight of all the patients that you're seeing on a specific day and what forms they've filled out and if they've got any medical alerts that may need your attention before they arrive at the practice. You can see different days. So we are just looking at the 24th of November. But if you wanted to go to a different day, you can do that by just using the arrows or by just typing in the date that you wish to go to. So the patient portal forms will work this way from version 13.243 upwards. So that is just something to bear in mind. Thank you so much for watching this video today and I hope that you found it helpful.